Hello, Internet, and welcome to my live reaction for Chapter 12 of uh, Demon's Plan. This is also the final chapter because Demon's Plan got cancelled like we all kind of knew it would. Yeah, I'm not too happy about that. I especially thought that we would have a lot longer than this, seeing how there still is, like, a lot more, a lot of shit to do. Like, we still got everything with Velvet and the Dogma and Patron and Carlos that seem like fairly important uh, issues, but I guess we might not get to see all that ever. Which is a shame, which is a damn shame. But we still have one chapter to go, so let's see how they clear it all up. Uh, we had Boro laying my one last attack on uh, Rob Leon, and now we got this two desk crater, one full power attack. Process 12 once more. And then Yus just kind of like walks up. Is he dead? He regains consciousness, so regenerate again. And then everything we've done will all be for naught. So he seems like cuts himself in some kind of rock? He may have monstrous power, but my red armor can withstand more. No matter how much he heals, it won't matter if he can't move. Wait, what? Oh, he's using armor to bind him there. Okay. We'll bind him here to the spot with my blood. Red armor. And with that, it's all over. What? Okay. You're too nice. But it's because you make these kind of choices that I decided to I could rely on you. 56 years. Yeah. Shall we move on? Uh, okay, so maybe they're trying to frame just the Robleon fight as the end of the series, which is weird, because there are a lot of things left unanswered. Okay. So now we're back at, um, Eustace's sister's house. And they're all kind of, and... They're all kind of like by the sister's uh, bedside. You can relax now. The village is safe. Well then, I'll be leaving. Hey, is that all? Yeah, let's go. Thank you, brother. Aw, she knew the entire time. Whoa, what? I think you've got the wrong idea. I'm not your brother. I'm not anything. Just someone passing by. You really are stupid. I may not be able to see anymore, but I can tell. That you are my one and only sibling. And they both cry. My life has truly been happy. And Spor kind of like chuckles and Salvia kind of looks on. In order to satisfy his own greed, he destroyed his own little sister's life. Use. I'm so happy. Um, with that, we've cleared one's day, Jay. What are you planning on doing now? Are you planning on pulling those two apart and taking use with you? Well, I thought about it. And for the time being, I'm going to search for Carlos. Sheesh, you're a piece of work, you know that? And he notices, you hear something. Oh, it's Patron. How do I, I kind of have a feeling the series is going to end with, like, Borob dying. <laughs> like, right now. Well, well, you even defeated Robleon. How very impressive. Patron. It's been quite a while. How have you been? Who's that? I told you about him before. He's the one that gave the demon's plan to Carlos and me. And he, he jumps down, and Salvia, like, freaks out. <laughs> He's the one that gives out the demon's plan? So then, he knows my brother? Foo-foo. <sighs> Excuse me. I congratulate you on defeating Rob Leon. Allow me to tell you something interesting about Master Carlos. Huh? Huge waves were made that led to this fight happening, and the biggest impetus of all was... Carlos Dia Rose crushing one of the seats of Dogma, and becoming its new member. Okay, that's a little OP. The fight was so intense that it had made your it had made your hair stand on end. He was up against ten opponents, which included the upper echelon of demons. But by just killing the head, he immediately seized control and influence over everyone beneath it. Wait, he killed Velvet? Okay. <laughs> Carlos is a part of Dogma? Yes. Uh, you take your eyes off them for just a moment, and oh, how they grow. And as we speak, he's getting poised to overthrow the balance within Dogma. Right now, Dogma is split into three groups. There are three who wish to fight, there are three who wish not to fight, and there are four who are neutral. The Angerist was killed by Carlos the other day. It was one of the who was killed by Carlos the other day was one of the opposition. Master Carlos is the is part of those that agreed to fight, which now makes it four against two, with four that are neutral. And with that, I who had been previously neutral plan to align, my, align myself with the agreeing faction to accelerate us toward more battling. Wait, 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 wait. 
Why is he? Why are they setting this up like they still have like a manga left? There are seven pages left in the series, right? And with that, I, who had previously been neutral, plan to align myself with the agreeing faction to accelerate us towards more battling. You? Neutral? Wait, so, so Patron's a demon, then? Okay, okay. Someone has appeared to stir up civil war amongst Dogma, which had previously reached a stalemate from being too powerful. I dare say that was the exact development I had hoped for. Master Carlos has become the ultimate game piece for me. Let me introduce myself. Once more, as one of the seats of Dogma, the demons, the demon governed by desire for knowledge, the Informationist. You're one of them, too? Wait, you hadn't figured that, that out when he said that he had changed sides? As the Informationist, I seek all information, wherever it may be. Miss Salvia, your older brother, he is also participating in this fight, I believe. If you head west from here, you will find a land which only demons are allowed to enter. A place where all desires come together. Lux Magna. Wait, 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 did the author write this before they told him he was getting cancelled? Because that's kind of what, what I'm gathering from all this. This is where the battle will happen. Fufu. Yes, it is happening exactly as I've outlined. The fight will be between your precious destructionist, Master Carlos, and Lady Salvia's brother, the revengist, Master Zebro. And, oh, he flashed like the world. Right, right, I've heard it. Has he always had that ability where he, like, breaks the world like glass and walks through it or whatever? I will be participating in this battle along with Master Carlos. Most likely, as someone seeking to profit from this fight, the domineerist Velvet will also be participating. If you intend to see how this all plays out, you should both come as well. I will be waiting for you. And he just leaves with three pages left. It can't be. Brother is... What should I do? I heard everything. And as Eustace, I'll lend you my strength. Boro, I have a debt to you that I can never repay, even with death. As promised, you may use my life however you see fit. And Salvius kind of like looks sad. What shall we do, Boro? And Boro thinks about everything with Carlos. Carlos. It's obvious, isn't it? Carlos and Salvius' brother. I'm going to protect them all. After all, I'm the protectionist demon. And they just kind of like look at him. Ha! As if it were that easy. Well, I figured you'd say as much. Let's go, Boro. You better go buy tickets. And he looks at the old sign of Boro and Carlos. Yeah, no matter what it takes, I'll return to that place once more with Carlos. And I'll never lose him again. Uh, thank you to our beloved readers. Please look forward to Okamoto, uh, Okamoto Sensei's next work. Volume 1 goes on sale in April, Volume 2 goes on sale in May. So they're not even gonna try to have an ending for this series. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. That's... Certainly... A way to go about it. I guess. Uh... I can't say I'm not disappointed by the ending. Uh, what with it just kind of stopping, right, as we're about to have the fight between, um, Carlos and Salvia's brother. Um, but, yeah, that's, that's, that's it. Um, I, 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 in this part of the video, I can talk about, like, what I expect to happen next, but, like, there is no next. And there should be a next. Uh, it's not like it came to, like, any kind of resolution, it just kind of, like, stopped. Right, is they're about to start another arc. Um, and there's, I highly doubt Shonen Jump's gonna let him have a sequel. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's, that's how it all played out. We never really got any kind of real resolution to the series. Which is not good. Not good at all. Um, but yeah, yeah, that's kind of, kind of it. I mean, I'm not exactly happy with how it all, how it all just kind of stopped. Like, none of the, like, actual material of the ending was bad, it just that, like, it wasn't an ending. <laughs> it just kind of, like, stopped there. I'm, I'm guessing it's because they didn't let, they didn't tell Okamoto that, like, the series was ending until after he finished this chapter, which is not a good thing to do. <laughs> um, but, uh, I don't know. I really don't know what to think about it. I, I liked I liked the series as a whole. Like in case you couldn't tell, I've, I've been doing this for like three months now, and I really really enjoy it. 
really enjoyed it, but it just it just ended, it just kind of stopped, which is not how you want a series to play out. You want to have some kind of resolution for things, not just like built, like literally ended on like here's the next art coming up and then stop your series. That's that's not good. <laughs> uh, it's not like there's some. It's not like an adaptation that's cut short. We can't go find the original because this this is the original. But yeah, that 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 sucks. It really sucks. I keep saying that because it's a cute second. Um, but yeah, that's really all I got to say. Um, I mean. God, I don't even know. I don't even know where I'm going to go with this uh, video. guess the lesson here is never trust a Shonen Jump series to last very long. <laughs> um, so if you want to, I don't know, if you ended up liking my videos just from this series, I still do have, I'm still reviewing like three other series right now. Uh, if I ever get a flame, I like three videos for today. Uh, Fairy Tale and Bordeto. So you can look at those all up in my channel. Uh, so I hope you enjoyed the series and the video. I certainly did. Uh, you can like, subscribe, do whatever the fuck you want. I don't really care. And as always, guys, uh, keep kicking ass, and I'll see you in the future. Bye.